We start our tour across the Caribbean by looking at Hispaniola, where we have a frontal system across the Dominican Republic, Haiti, as well as Jamaica. You can just see it here, that line of cloudiness stretching out towards the Atlantic. It's basically now become a stationary front, so you've got some cold air towards the north, warm air meeting it from the south, and that, that mixture is basically going to bring a lot more cloudiness and some showers. Also the possibility of one or two of those showers becoming heavy, especially across the hillsides of Hispaniola. So no surprise then, we'll keep those showers up for Port-au-Prince and Santo Domingo as we go through Thursday. Should begin to clear Port-au-Prince by Friday, but hang around across Santo Domingo as we start the weekend. And for Jamaica, they also will be seeing those showers. At 30 degrees Celsius, it will feel comfortable with some of those showers, especially across the hillsides, could also turn heavy. And there's also the icy thunderstorm likely in some areas. But for the Leeward Islands, on the other side of that frontal system, it's mostly fair, just the usual trade wind flow, bringing those occasional showers. But down towards the south, around the Windward Islands, then down towards uh, Guyana, we have basically been seeing some moisture developing here. We could be seeing some of that moisture turning into longer spells of rain, maybe just an isolated thunderstorm as well by the time we get to Friday for both uh, St. Vincent, Grenada, Trinidad and Tobago, and maybe down towards Georgetown as well. So that's your Caribbean forecast, and that's it from me.